game one got tight and uh, I was proud of our back end guys, proud of both Stids came in and, and uh, got good hitter, lead off hitter and got him to strike out to end the game and then came out here and uh, Eccles just did a great job and then pitching defense was outstanding. Like I said, we had that big second inning that kind of knocked that, I think knocked the air out of him a little bit and it was a good thing because I think our legs got pretty heavy there late in the game. Now that you've been able to get this team kind of some regular work, I mean, you played, what, six or seven games the first three weeks. Now this team's got a rhythm. You've seen a lot of people step up. Your pitchers have stepped up. Riley Eccles this week, two starts, and the bat's behind him, giving him 20 runs, and he's only allowed one. Just kind of talk about some of the guys that have kind of stepped up and made this little eight-game winning streak possible. Well, it's like anything else. I think one of the strengths for our team is uh, there's not really one guy or two or three guys. They all kind of, it's kind of evened out and spread out. And, and But Eccles, like I said, the last two starts have been, been outstanding. And of course, uh, uh, Brandon Hagler, his last two starts, and, and really just competing, coming at him and, and coming right at the hitters and, and throwing a lot of strikes and letting the defense work behind him. And, and Bo Stitch, if you look at last week, he got two wins. And, and they, they were in big, tight situations, and today was a big, tight when he got, got a situation, he got the save in. So those guys, and what they're doing is they're competing and they're, they're pitching to the defense and, and letting their defense do the work. And, and like I said, our defense, and Tyler Langley's played well through the stretch. and offensively but also defensively. It's nice to have a guy out there that can run down. You mentioned Bo Stitch. I know you're still early, but what he did last year out of your bullpen really solidifying things in the middle of even a long relief situation. And here early in the season, two quick wins and able to call on him in the ninth inning with the bases loaded. He's been one of those glue guys in this, in this whole staff, hasn't he? He has, man. There's, there's no question about that. And, and like I said, he challenges him. He comes at him and challenges him. And, and uh, and that's been it's been nice. Like I said, he's been we've put him in some tough situations. He's done very well. Offensively, I think you're seeing the results now of a balanced lineup from top to bottom. We have Langley and even Logan Preston at the bottom of the lineup. You know you've got a pretty good lineup from top to bottom, and that's causing a lot of pressure on other pitchers. Yeah, and our bottom of the order's done well. Our top of the order's struggling a little bit right now, I think. But uh, you know we just they'll, they'll come through. Like I said, well, they were gonna do well, it they're. Like I said, I, I, I think we're pretty balanced there so far we have been, and, and hopefully that continues. Well, obviously a great start to your conference season. Now you hit the road again, but it's good to get home and get well and get three wins. Oh, no no question about that. And today uh, the crowd was great. A lot of people are really appreciate that. I know our players do as well. And then, uh, like I said, it was great to see the sun come out today. Just kind of feed off the crowd. The crowd's hungry for baseball, too. No, uh, no doubt. You could tell there were, there were a lot of people excited about good weather and baseball out there today. It was, it was fun to be a part of. Well, great day, and uh, let's keep it going. You bet. Thanks, Steve.